Iburu, Mboya, Ibu Cheche, everybody in Cyberland. As always, it's your fair bow allow. At least I hope so. Omoodun, Odileke, coming at you with another video. And this one's gonna be a sequel to the Help Me, Help You video seek, uh, series that I put out there before. Uh, I know I've been taking a little bit of break from that and I've been posting other videos uh, because I want to make sure that we're hitting milestone feast days, one. Two, there's been some big announcements and some previous um, videos that were released. Uh, but more importantly, I want to make sure that I'm collectively making videos for the masses, right? Um, but now that I've kind of started to knock out some of those other videos, I wanted to get back to the Help Me, Help You series because it's important. It's very, very important. So this one goes out to one of our followers who hit me up. Uh, in their Mano de Orula, they have the sign of Ofun Batrupon. Okay? That's Ofun Otrupon. When I think about Ofun Otrupon, and we talk about the aspect of the guardian orisha being oya we have to really dig deep this is not one where we can look at the icing of the cake we got to dig a little deeper we got to carve into this cake and look at the layers so a couple of things i want you to remember when we talk about ofun batrupon we talk about the comprehension of life we talk about a person who doesn't necessarily fully understand everything and if they're doing well for themselves they're very lucky at the fact that they can conceal their confusion very well because of the confusion that surrounds them the confusion could sometimes be isolated it could be something where it can be confusion at a workplace confusion in a home confusion in a spiritual house that but that confusion begins to build and this is where we have to be very careful if you are living with that confusion you have to make sure that that confusion is not overwhelming has the ability to have Aron chasing it Aron illness Right? But specifically illness of the head and the stomach. You remember growing up where they say, hey, don't stress too much, you're going to give yourself an ulcer? That's what they're talking about. Don't stress too much, you're going to give yourself an aneurysm. Those things are real when we talk about this odu. Specifically when we talk about this odu and we talk about your guardian Orisha being Oya, we talk about Oya being a very temperamental energy that likes to flip around personalities one day you're happy one day uh, you're angry and you have to be very very careful about how you react to things that you comprehend has a problem with comprehension more to a point that it will cause chaos let me explain why through a pataki there was a pataki when we talk about the, the tower of uh, Babel, right? This is where, and, uh, and, and and this is in Genesis as well. This is a, a biblical story just as much as it's an Ifa story, right? And it began to build this giant tower that's supposed to reach the heavens, and all mankind is, is, is together, and they're talking one language, and they're working together to build something. But because of their disobedience, in Ifa or Lofi, and in the Bible, I can't remember how that got spun, but I'll talk Ifa. Or Lofi then created the dialects in different languages. Now imagine this you have a blueprint for a building, you're all working towards the same goal, and all of a sudden, people start talking different languages. Alright? People don't understand each other, and confusion comes. That's what Ofum Batrupon sometimes walks like. Confused. Not understanding. And because they get confused, 
It irritates them. It makes them act a little different, whether it's irrational, whether it's uh, maybe they're embarrassed, uh, you know, self-esteem issues to a certain extent. So, ofum batrupo, please, 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 don't walk confused. You just have to work a little harder for deeper understanding. Don't be afraid to ask questions. No question is, is a dumb question. And that's a real thing. Especially for this sign. Especially when I just explained to you why the confusion and why that comprehension causes medical problems. Why is it that Oya is the one that corrals the Egums and that's your guardian Orisha? Why Oya, one of the few Orishas with a pack with Iku, don't let the illness get you to the point where Iku is going to get you. That's why I told you. It's a little deeper. We have to look deeper when we talk about people like Oya. When we talk about Oya, we also like to mention the marketplace. And why is that important for Ofun Batrupon? Ofun Batrupon likes money. Man, you value money. And you value the material life too much, too much, too much. You have to start to organize yourself and understand that money is not everything. And I get it. That's easier said than done sometimes. But your blessings come when you least expect it. That is the beauty of a fuma home. But you have to have your faith and you have to be able to work your faith. A fuma home, typically, a lot of a fuma homes will start to receive their divinities, will get crowned, will, will become Bawalaos. Um, it's a good sign. It's a good sign. Because it's a good spiritual sign to do great things. Um, and what that means is, is that Elewa, Ishu, Olodumari, right? Everybody blesses you. Your sign mentions Olofi. Right? You have the blessings of Olofi. Let that energy run through you. If you do that and you stay religious and spiritual and you work those angles, you will be successful. You will be. It is only when you abandon and you forget and you blame the Egums and the Orishas for all your problems that you will see the failures and you will see Aron and your illnesses begin to worsen. You have to humble yourself, you have to have faith, and you need to take uh, one step at a time. I give you another pataki. And it's the one where the farmer that owns the palm trees that line up on the river, and the river is going up, right? And people can't cross it, and a king comes and says, hey, can I knock down, can, can, you, you know, can you cut one of your palm trees for me? I'll give you some money so I can cross this river. And the farmer says, sure. And the farmer had a man. He had a whole farm of palm trees lined up. He kept chopping them, chopping them, chopping them. So he only had a few left. And he goes to Orula. He asks Orula, Orula, what do I do? I only have a few palm trees left. Orula said, hey, stop cutting them down. They're more value added to you up than they are down. You're doing it for the quick buck. And Ofumba Trupon does things for the quick buck. So be careful. Be careful, please. Ofumba Trupon, in your own house, you sometimes feel like people don't understand what you're saying. People are not getting you. And that causes chaos as well. That's Ofumba Trupon. Maybe your family doesn't understand you, your friends, your co-workers. So please, please, please be careful with that. And do not have weapons. Don't own a gun. Don't do any of that. You know why? Because people are going to get you to the point where you're going to get so agitated that you may use that gun. So with that said, Ofum Batrupon, with Oya. Oya, another reason why you shouldn't have weapons in the house. Oya should not have weapons in the house. This is why we have to learn who's our guardian Odisha and what's our sign. Hopefully I gave you something, Ofumba Trupon, with Omo Oya. And I hope you enjoyed this video. 
Many blessings to you and everybody else who's tuning in and everybody else who's a kum batrupon. It's a spiritual sign. It's a beautiful sign. If you work the faith, you're going to be great. You, you, you'll be greater than them all. You'll be greater than me. I promise you that. Work the faith. Have faith. Have patience. Have humility. Ask questions. And you will learn the things you need to learn to be successful. With that said, Iburu, Iboya, Bucheche, Cyberland, always a pleasure. Many thanks for tuning in. Give me a subscribe. Give me a like. Give me a share. We're almost at a thousand. All right. I think last I checked, we were at 981, 982. So keep it going. We're almost there. Iburu, Iboya, Bucheche, Cyberland.